We're not going to type a whole biography in a title. Hey everybody, it's Ariana the Dawn back with another video tonight. So tonight is an exciting video for the new year. If I started a YouTube channel in 2024, I'll do this. YouTube is in this new era. Okay, girly, I see you, YouTube. I see you, girl. You are flourishing. You're helping people grow. You're getting people fan base, a community. People can make money off being themselves and this is why I love this platform the most like it's an art you get paid off being an artist first things first we're gonna pick a niche whether it's beauty is gaming is fitness um reason why I say that because if you have a channel and you're doing you know you got freaking gaming you got work you got gaming then you want to do this workout video that's just too much confusion when you're doing so many things at once especially with starting out pick one niche don't confuse people your your goal is to create a community grow a fan base have people relate to you so we want to keep it simple okay step at a time i mean once you're like blow up then you could do other things on your channel but when you pick one thing out of your niche it will help with growth and growth in a specific audience number two your title okay this is a new thing with youtube like we're gonna make it simple under 60 characters simple short catchy bold wording no bold letters youtube loves it the audience love it the algorithm the algorithm loves it you know what i'm saying we want to we're not going to type a whole biography in a title no we're not doing that we're not going to have to work on that fear you have we're not going to let your insecurities get in the way of you making content this is 2024 everybody's trying to get into their youtube bag you let your insecurities get in the way of you creating content realize I struggled with that too clearly these few couple of days I just left work I've been vlogging at work a day in a life of working in a nail salon a day in a life of a poor nail tech a black poor nail tech this just catchy well I capitalize poor reels I've been making shorts I mean I've been making shorts they've blown up I've had three shorts on me showing you guys throughout my day working in a nail salon they blew up. They performed so well. My YouTube, my account right now is really in the green check marks. My channel is doing really good right now. I'm telling y'all. I did something different. I reevaluate. I reevaluated my channel, myself, things I needed to change. I'm working on it still, but yeah. You don't want nothing too busy and you don't want nothing too boring. Um something creative simple the main focus is maybe the pictures the picture you put in it will draw in the attention and maybe one little title on it like one sentence that's it maybe one arrow towards the object or whatever you're talking about use a hashtag site to get hashtags that are related that are relatable to your video it tells the algorithm what your video is about when you put hashtags and it helps with being searchable. So we need our hashtags, baby. Schedule. We need to make a schedule for when you're posting. People are waiting to see you. People love when you're prompt, you're proactive, and you have a schedule. You know, they're prepared on what day you're going to drop a video, what time, you know. People love it. People love that you're organized. People love that you're hungry. People love that you're determined. You really care about what you do. You take your channel serious. It's lighting, baby. When you're recording on camera, we want to see you, baby. We, we don't want to see you in the dark. When you're recording on camera, we need lights, camera, action. We need all that energy, you know? Lighting. Have your lighting behind your device, your camera, etc., phone, whatever it may be. Natural lighting is the best lighting. Like, God, light is the best light. The sunlight. Ooh. But 
You can use a ring light. You can use a studio light. Buy you one off Amazon. Just sit that bad boy right behind the camera, your device. And let us see that beautiful face of yours. And record your content because you might got good t content. You you got, you know what you're talking about. Distracted by this low quality, this fuzzy. What am I looking at? Paranormal activity too? Like, I need to see crisp a bit. It don't have to be 4K. It can be 1080. You know, it'll be that quality. But I need a light behind that, baby. You know, quality is... I'm clicking off the video. Because that's another thing. Stop having a mindset. Oh, I need a camera. First of all, you ain't even started the channel yet. You don't know how the channel's going to turn out. You don't know. Start off with your phone. That's what I did. I work hard towards my camera. I didn't buy myself a camera. Well, I need a camera. I only got one subscriber. Um, yeah, you can use your phone. Get you a little light. Create. And get into the last two things of the YouTube updates. YouTube shorts, baby. Get into that. If you don't want to just do shorts, do both. Long form video. Me, I got to do both. I'm not just going to do shorts because I love creating long form but, um me researching how to grow my channel how to be a better youtuber i've been doing i've been watching videos from everybody especially videos from think media he really helped me and another girl named there's so many youtubers that just helped me in these few weeks that i've seen progress now i'm taking it not trying to play victim anymore with this channel i'm not trying to play the race card it's not all oh, the algorithm hates me because i'm black it's been brainwashed it's not that it's just your videos suck it's just my videos was sucky but that's neither here or there you guys haven't even started yet but what I'm saying is we're not gonna use excuses either we're not gonna do that for 2024 this is what I'm going to do for 2024 when I start my channel I'm going to have gratitude even when it's get hard I'm gonna still keep posting I'm still gonna keep posting that's what you guys are gonna do so um yeah as I was saying these shorts baby they can outperform your long form videos. Nobody wants to say it, but I'm speaking on it. I've gained subscribers for my three shorts. That was only 60 seconds compared to my like 30 minute video. I'm hurt about that, yes. But that just tells me YouTube is trying. He, they want us to gear over to getting into shorts, you know, making our life easier if we want to get something out do it in 60 seconds the goal is to try to make the audience happy where it's not for our personal we're it's a business baby we're not trying to please ourselves we're trying to please our audience we're trying to grow community that's our main goal for 2024 take the emotion out of creating content and start to create for others start to relate to others start so as I'm telling you new youtubers start off strong don't just do it for the money don't have the mindset oh I just want to make money I want to do YouTube no if you're gonna do it you're gonna have to love it you know you once you get into it, you have to love what you do you have to you have to do it out of enjoyment not for the money because you're doing it for the wrong reasons you're not get you're not going to get where you want to be I'm telling y'all as y'all big sis is not going to be easy i'm on the way to 7k myself i'm still considered a small youtuber and i still have good i have gratitude i'm still thankful to god he's helped showing me the way yes hopefully i hope to grow into bigger and better i've been doing this for a few years and that's okay People been doing it for 10 years, plus, boom, they famous. People been doing it for a month, boom, they famous. Famous, not, well, big. Everybody path is different. Don't think, well, she, she, she did one, two videos, and now she has a 100K subscribers. That's her path, baby. She figured it out. She know what the people like. That's her blessing. That's her. Don't compare yourself to others. Be consistent. They say be consistent. Not only you have to be consistent, but you have to know what the audience, you have to always test the waters. Try a little, dibble and dabble, tweak a little things. Fix your title, fix your thumbnail, you know. In this new time, in this new day and time, look, 
try to solve issues people have you know what i'm saying that's my main thing i noticed youtube is trying to give small channels more love now i've i've been every so many small youtubers i've been subscribing to everybody the ones that i like and i'm like oh my gosh they really wipe they're really blowing the dust off people channels they may have haven't posted in the years haven't posted in years or isn't consistent youtube is really trying to help the earliest like if you just follow if you just do what they say you'll be good but we're in our new youtube era everybody's trying to be in their content creating bag but yeah y'all yeah y'all um thank you guys for tuning in i am sitting in my car in front of best buy but i just got off work i'm about to head home but i just want to say until next video bye y'all